In this video, we will show you how to resolve a problem when we are trying to login to our VPS or our virtual machine using PuTTY application, its appear error message, no supported authentication methods available, server send, public key. How this happen? Okay, we will show you again when we try to open our PuTTY, okay, and inputting our IP or hostname and click open the error is appear after we input the username like this you can see to solve this problem first this because the authentication you don't have okay so you need to provide the authentication the authentication is related to the ppk files or dot pm files if you have .pam files, you need to convert into .ppk because .pam is support in the older PuTTY version. I'm using PuTTY for the newest version. So, how to get the .ppk or .pam files? You need to contact your virtual machine provider or your VPS provider. Then try to get your .ppk or .pam files. Okay, after you get .ppk .pm files, then you can try to reopen your PuTTY. Okay, I will try to reopen my PuTTY and input your IP address. After you input your IP address, go to SSH. Okay, then please click this expand and select out. Okay, click expand again and select credentials. Now, you need to browse .ppk files here. Okay, then we can click open. Okay, after you have these top .ppk files, then you can click open. Usually, your provider will provide .pam files. You can convert .pam into .ppk files. After that, you can click open to try connect into your virtual machine again. Then let's try and hit the enter. Okay. Now you are done to insert or login into your virtual machine or your VPS without any error existing. Okay, that's all tutorial how to resolve a problem related into the authentication when we are trying to login our VPS or virtual machine using PuTTY application. If you have any question, you can fill in the forms comment below. Thanks for watching and hope this video helpfully for you.